Welcome to the race team. Thank you all for coming. It's such a beautiful day here in Bermuda at the Bermuda Middle School Race Park. And enjoy ourselves for the Mike North Ski Susan Team event. We wanted to do something a little bit different than regular trophy days. Um, try to bring everyone back together. We randomized drawing. It'd be nice if you guys could really, you know, get together with your teammates and strategize if you need to, help each other when you need to. However you finish is how your team does the day. Yeah, we're down here at Southside Raceway. And we're mixing things up a little bit today. We're doing team races. So each drivers, we're all randomly picked. I think it's teams of six, five teams of six. So a little interesting, little, little team rottery going on. So it should make for a fun day. One lap to start, seven lap race. Don't forget drivers to put your right hand up. I think it's the first time that uh, I've ever done anything like this, so I think it's a great idea. It, uh, it builds morale for, for, the, for the younger kids. My dad asked me if I wanted to go kart racing. One of my dad's friends brought his taxi and he had a go kart and he had my go kart in it. So I was like, Sweet. My dad kind of got me into it when he bought me my first fun kart. I love it so far. We love sports, we love motor sports. You can't get it out of your blood, man. Once you have it, that's it, you know. First thing I think about when I race them is adrenaline. Um, speed, just the rush, uh, excitement. Well, then I'll get run out or I won't get the place I want. If you're just pumped and ready to go, try and win. Maybe 80 miles per hour, about half an inch off the ground. You don't know what's going to happen next if you're going so fast. It's speed, that's, that's it. Excitement or like... Like you know, trying to get to that corner, doing one mile an hour faster than you did the last lap. You just use all your strength to try and go around it. For me, it's just freedom. I get to relax. When I get behind that wheel, I put my helmet on, it calms me down. I don't think about anything else besides the race. That's all that's in my mind. Man, let's get out there, go give it 100%. It's been going great, man. We had a great spectator turnout. Uh, good vendors down here. Our rental program, as you can see over there, is doing wonders for the club. Up in your heels. Push it forward. See over here. What we got is we uh, brought in a tech guy from the United States to uh, um, strip down and, and, and check over, in a technical aspect, the top three points um, in our series in different classes. Are you guys ready for the first crunch match? Um, things went off very well today. Uh, we had a record number of carts on the track for uh, this year so far. So that's positive. I got six wins out of six, so that's that's even better. <laughs> Put a lot of work into this, um, you know, getting the trophies here, organizing and stuff like that. Um, my, my team owner, Team Itaw Kart, um, the Corrado family, they're the ones that I, they're the reason I race, they, they supply the carts and I, I, I drive them. It's an honor and a privilege to be able to do this and I, uh, I hope my dad's watching, I really do. Uh, it means a lot to me, I know it means a lot to Jason to be able to put this on. You guys got a little group picture here, you guys? Um, but yeah, the main thing was just, you know, remembering, you know, lost loved ones and that was for everybody, you know. Um, anybody that's lost loved ones in the, in the past that have been involved in racing, you know, he was trying to bring awareness to that.